Uh, I love the Bible. And if you put every copy ever sold end to end, uh, you have way too much time on your hands. And consider using that cosmic power for something much more, uh, much more useful. Now, there were six stone water jars there for the Jewish rites of purification, each holding 20 or 30 gallons. Uh, odd thing number one, you've got to feel sorry for poor Shirley and Steve. They're not even mentioned. Whose wedding is it? We have no idea. No Dennis and Barbara, no Mildred and Paul. Probably the most famous wedding in human history, uh, and uh, they're unnamed. But maybe because they ran out of wine, uh, they spared their embarrassment and didn't put their names in. That's why Jesus, you know, he sort of avoided the scene uh, by changing water into wine, which is why people think Christianity is so incredibly middle class. Eloi, Eloi, lama sabachthani. So we get that uh, in Matthew, when Jesus is on the cross. Now, if you only know one phrase of Aramaic, that is probably not the most useful one to know. If you're asking the way to the railway station, you know, or somebody asks you the, rail, the way to the railway station, and you say, Eloi, Eloi, lama sabachthani. Like, all right, they've been privatised, but they need to be quite that full of despair. No parables in John's Gospel. Uh, so uh, I wrote one. Early manuscripts do not include the following. Then Peter told them this parable. Suppose one of you has a hundred keys and loses one. Does he not leave the 99 keys, shout loudly and say, where on earth did I put that key? And will his wife not say to him, where did you last have it? And will he not reply, well, if I knew that, I wouldn't have lost it, would I? What happens to the stick when Moses turns it onto the ground? It turns into a snake. Again, you would think, Psh, wow, amazing. Yes, I'm your man. No, what happens? He throws it onto the ground. It becomes a, uh, a snake. And what happens? Moses goes, snake! <laughs> Nathaniel said to him, can anything good come out of Nazareth? What's wrong with Nazareth? Nathaniel said to him, what's right with Nazareth? Am I right? Nathaniel raised a hand for Philip to high five, but Philip high fived him not. Don't leave me hanging, said Nathaniel. This is not the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God.